2000. So we'll put it uh, two-speed motor. We'll put it in low. Now that drops it down to a thousand. And we'll show you the, the thread uh, there. inch three jaw a 10 inch four jaw they're both buck chucks ways are really nice this is a gap bed it's eight and a quarter inches in length you got a five inch follow rest five inch steady rest two axis sony digital readout coolant pan chip pan coolant pump there's that 10 inch four jaw all the change gears you could want um, there's some extra pins with brass ends for these steady and follows. Uh, very nice placard. Lathe is in really nice shape. One in, uh, I got, I, I'm not certain. Uh, but it'll be in the quote exactly what that is, the measurement. I believe it's one and five eighths. But check the specs on the quote. It does have a com complete taper attachment. When I say complete, they're usually missing this. There's your coolant pump on and off. I can hit that switch and see if I can hear it. Sometimes you can hear it. It does work. We checked it. We cycled it. It's very quiet pump. So, uh, and that is back here. It's got its own nice little cabinet in here. And uh, it is wired 220. And since it's a two speed motor, I think it has to be wired 220 three phase. I don't think it can be changed. There's your key to your cabinet. Other than that, I do not know what else to say other than Let's make some chips.